today is <coughs> Monday the 12th? 12th. 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 I am just uploading to Instagram and Michael made me a beautiful breakfast. And um, on Mondays I speak like this. I don't know what I'm doing. We're having French toast and eggs for breakfast. Look at it. Show the pic. Show. It's perfect. It's perfect. French toast and eggs for breakfast. And just watching news and kind of chilling. So we'll keep you updated throughout the day. Today's going to be mostly work day, work day though, so. You get to see Hannah's process. Actually, you kind of already have, so. Yeah. Yeah. So Michael wanted me to show you guys that he pretty much cleaned out the office quite nicely. So it looks a lot better. Hi, Mila. I still need to vacuum the floor and stuff, but. This is a way better workspace. Now I just have to sort of tidy this up a little bit and I'm going to go, I'm going to start my nail art for today. Today the prompt is um, graveyard, I believe. Yeah, graveyard. So I'm going to do that and um, I'll kind of show you little bits along the way. Not done yet. I'm in the middle of the nail art, but I've got an kind of spooky gradient going on <clears throat> and I'm about to stamp some like a spooky castle house I doubt you'll really be able to see much detail but I don't know maybe a little bit and then like some tombstones and stuff like that and then hopefully this nail art will look complete and Michael is in the kitchen making some delicious smelling Mexican food so can't wait for that Michael made burritos and they're so good a master at their work Hannah works diligently Attempting to stamp the elusive tombstone onto her finger. Yeah, turned out okay. Success! <laughs> <laughs> Remind me of that guy that, that does the, the, the rich and famous show, the British guy. <laughs> <laughs> that thing. I assume Hannah showed you all this, so I don't even know what I'm walking around, but... Hopefully you guys can see it a lot better than you were able to in... I think that was yesterday's vlog. They're very s sweet little animals. Tell this turns into a fight. Sometimes it turns into a fight, because... It's a play fight, though. Yeah, it's a play fight, because either... Miles no longer wants to clean her, and then so he tries to go away, and he tries to pull her back, or she gets all excited and happy, and when she does that, she gets crazy, and yeah. So for those of you who don't know, my degree is in geology, and just as Hannah is a total nerd with all her nail polish, I am a total nerd with all my rocks, and these are just my specimens that are beautiful enough and small enough to fit up on the shelf, but I got couple of shelves here with some rocks on it. I got a shelf here with some rocks on it. The bottom drawer. <coughs> this bottom drawer is all full of rocks and rock supplies. As well as this shelf in our living room, which are my nice kind of shelf specimens. But besides that, I have a very big under the bed box that is completely stuffed full of rocks and about six or so paper boxes full of rocks. Most of which I've collected, other some of which I've purchased. Or I gave you. Or she gave me. I bought some good rocks for you. Yeah, you found some good rocks for me too. Yeah, I'm a good rock hounder. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be really fun. I mean, by that I mean like really impossible and difficult and hard and horrible to move with all your rocks. It was last time. You had a... a 20th of the rocks that you have now though oh yeah that big under the bed bin <laughs> that i was saying that was completely full my plan was to move it into a bunch of different boxes to make it easier to move well the the movers which consisted of my father and his brother-in-law and the such they decided let's just move it so before i even knew they decided let's pick it up and haul it off and it's like they broke their backs it's like 150 pounds at least so two people lifting this big, fragile bin. I mean, it's basically just like a storage tote. A bigger storage tote, but a little bit flimsier than a regular storage tote. Full of over 100 pounds. 
So I finished my nails and I highly doubt I'm going to be able to get an okay picture of it. But I'll, I'll pop up the, my edited nice picture. Um, <clears throat> and for this manicure I used um, Chana Glaze Glitter Goblin, which is, I love this one from a few years back in the Halloween collection. Um, Chana Glaze Roguish Red, another good one, and Chana Glaze Velvet Bow. These are all kind of like oldies but goodies. And then, um, Winstonia Plate, um, which one is this? W, hey, you can kind of see me. This is W116, and then this one is Bundle Monster 305, and then this one is Bundle Monster... Wow, you like totally can't see anything. I'm sorry. Um, this is Bundle Monster H08. But yeah, that's what I use to do this manicure. So Hannah's just about ready to cut my hair. Not really sure how well you guys can see it. I'm going to shave and cut all this junk off and all that stuff. So use it before. Let's see what it looks like after. He looks funny. I've only done the side so far and then I comb this up so that I can like get a good whatever. <laughs> That it looks weird. You look kind of weird now. Turn your head down a little bit. Yeah, that's just weird. Got five eighths here, seven eighths on top, and three quarters of blend in between. Shaved. It's not a perfect job, but I'm gonna spruce it up a little in the morning. But yeah, not too shabby. I think I look pretty good. Plus, it takes like ten years off of me, so there's always that too. Again. <laughs> Hello, or more like goodbye, because we're gonna wrap up the vlog, cause we's tired and it's after midnight, and I promised myself I would go to bed before midnight tonight, and it didn't happen again. <laughs> and you've got some businessy thing you've got to do in the morning, and I gotta get up early and film. So we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Okay, bye guys. Bye. Don't do it. Bye. Oh my god. <laughs>